Okay, well, I've been pretty busy tonight. Well, the last couple of days. I've had some fun making some of these. These glue pretty well just using 5 minute epoxy. Uh, this is called out in the plans as the way to do this. There's a number of places. Uh, Nat uh, Puffer, the designer of the Cozy, had uh, it laid out pretty much like this in the plans with those joints there, that those joints there. Now some guys choose to take the foam and just cut the whole bulkhead out of it. I didn't order huge amounts of foam uh, because I had to have it all imported. Uh, it took months to get here as you probably know. I ordered a minimal, minimal amount of, of foam as called out in the plans but it turns out the metric sheets are actually uh, that much bigger than the ones uh, originally called for in the plans that um, I've been able to use about half of the foam so far that I should have been using so, um, and I've only used one sheet out of two uh, which is actually quite astounding now you can see here that joint there and that joint there are not in the original plans so I've taken a little bit of liberty to make maximal use of the sheet that I did have because it was far a bit wider than expected and um, I've been able to take that off cut you know lap those uh, that piece and that piece there on and um, it's given me enough quite enough foam to make these bulkheads uh, quite comfortably so I was worried I was not going to have enough foam um, I am still a little bit concerned that I uh, screw one of these up uh, when I'm doing the glass layup. So this is all getting glass on both sides. This doubler goes on that piece to double up with glass. Uh, so it makes a triple layers. Glass on the back side, glass between the two, doubler goes on top and then glass on over all of that. Because that is a really uh, uh, stressful part of the structure. The canard, the front wing, is attached to that bulkhead there. So it really gets beefed up a lot. So that's me for now. Uh, next, as I said, we're doing the instrument panel. That's going to be it for the high density foam. Which I'm very glad about because cutting this is a pain. This is high density stuff and it's really tough to cut. See that uh, it looks foamy, but you see it's got kind of got a hard texture to it. That's real. That is, if I use all my strength, I might break it. No, I can't. <laughs> Impressive stuff. Okay.
So I've come to the conclusion Just to ride and be so Okay.